prison without the possibility of parole. That sentence today to a man convicted of murdering a veteran FDNY EMT. Jose Gonzalez hijacking Yadira Arroyo's ambulance and repeatedly driving over her before just taking off. It happened in the Bronx back in 2017. As the sentence was read, read today, legions of FDNY EMTs filled the courthouse in a show of support. With reaction, Eyewitnesses reporter Marcus Solis is outside the courthouse in the Melrose section. Marcus? Sade and Bill, her life mattered. The words of Yadira Roy's mother to her killer inside that courtroom today. The family finally getting some small measure of justice 2,232 days after she was killed. This means a lot to us. Her family was gifted the handcuffs used to arrest the suspect, and colleagues chanted her name. But a mother's pain still fresh, even after six long years. Today, FDNY EMT Yadira Arroyo's killer was sentenced to life in prison without parole. The trial was delayed time and time again because of hearings regarding the defendant's mental fitness to stand trial. But in the end, justice prevailed. In March 2017, Yadi, as she was known, was killed while on duty, run over by her own ambulance, trying to stop Jose Gonzalez from stealing it. In court, colleagues read victim impact statements describing the loss of the matriarch of EMS Station 26, a courtroom packed with dozens of FDNY co-workers. Yadira Arroyo served our city as a hero, and she died as a hero, and we will never forget her. Every day I wait for her to come home, says Arroyo's mother. In court, her sister read Leda Acevedo's statement, there is not a word in this world that can describe the feeling of losing a child. The excruciating pain is immeasurable. During the trial, and even today, defense lawyers argued Gonzalez wasn't aware of what was happening because he was high on marijuana and PCP. Gonzalez himself apologized, saying, I never meant to hurt anyone. I was intoxicated. It was an accident. Please forgive me. I feel like they were just empty words. I hope that, you know, while he's in prison, he can find himself and find the higher power. And he can really mean the words that he said today from his heart and not only speak them from his mouth. Well, in a statement, FDNY Commissioner Laura Cavanaugh said Yadira Arroyo was an extraordinary EMT who cared for her patients deeply. We are grateful her killer will never be on the streets again with no eligibility for parole. However, in court, uh, Rodri uh, Gonzalez's lawyer said that he does plan an appeal. And we're live outside Bronx Criminal Court. Marcus Solis, Channel 7, Eyewitness News. Marcus, thank you. E. Jean Carroll on the witness stand.